I was talking to Jen on Instagram and she asked why after six weeks of physical therapy for carpal tunnel was she still getting the pins and needles or tingling into half of her hand. She's right to be confused. Carpal tunnel is one of those conditions that can resolve themselves if they're treated correctly. The fact that Jen went to PT and is still having the tingling is telling me that the diagnosis of carpal tunnel is wrong. So I dug a little bit deeper and I asked Jen, which part of your fingers are getting the pins and needles? And she said, it's just my thumb and my index finger. This is great because this is telling me that this can be coming from three places really. It can be coming from her neck, it could be coming from the nerve as it exits the neck into the armpit, or it can be coming truly from the median nerve somewhere in the forearm or in the carpal tunnel itself. Because Jen also mentioned that she doesn't get these tingling sensations when she's sitting at her computer or using her shoulder, we instantly rule out that the nerve is getting stuck in her armpit. We need to dig a little bit further. I asked her, can you tell me specifically, is it your entire index finger or only half of your index finger? And she wasn't really sure about this and she got back to me about a day or two later and she said, you know what? It's only the inside of my index finger. And I said, this is awesome because what this is telling me clinically is that this isn't carpal tunnel. This is solely coming from her neck. Even if you are experiencing, like in Jen's case, tingling into your hand. So the good thing is that she reached out to us because no matter how much longer she would have gone to physical therapy and they would have been working on her forearm and working on her hand, those symptoms of the tingling would not have resolved. If Jen would have said her entire index finger and some of her middle finger and even part of her ring finger were experiencing the pins and needles, this would have been really true carpal tunnel, which means that the nerve is probably getting caught somewhere in the carpal at the wrist or somewhere along the forearm. So regardless if, if she had carpal tunnel or in her case that it's actually coming from her neck, the reason why she's getting these symptoms is because of a gluey substance that pins down the nerve. It's called adhesion. Adhesion is the most common cause of chronic pain that no one is talking about. And in Jen's case, it's been in her neck for a long time. She's gone to PT, she's gone to a massage, and she's still not getting any relief. Why? Because they're not looking in the right place. So if you have pins and needles in your hand and you've gone to physical therapy and they keep telling you it's carpal tunnel, guess what? It's probably not. You probably have adhesion somewhere in your neck or maybe in your case it's in the armpit. It doesn't matter. Adhesion can be removed without surgery and guess what? More importantly, you'll be pain free. If you have any questions, I'd love to talk with you. Have a great day.